Behold, the contact lens. But where did it come from? Meet Adolf Fick, born in Germany in 1852. Adolf came from a bright family. His father was a professor of anatomy and his uncle was a physiologist. Adolf didn't start out as an intrepid inventor, however. First, he fought in the Franco-Prussian War. After he returned, he studied ophthalmology, mm. and by 1875, he was a doctor. Eventually, Adolf found his way to Zurich, and it was here that he began researching what he called the contact spectacle. Today, we call these contact lenses. Adolf started by experimenting on the eyes of rabbits and corpses. Adolf wasn't the first person to conceive of a corrective lens placed directly on the eye, but he did make the first successful contact lens. Trust us, you wouldn't want to wear it. His contact lenses were scleral, meaning they fit on the white part of the eye. They were also made of glass and between 8 to 15 millimeters thick. They could only be worn for a few hours at a time. As successive researchers built lighter and more flexible contact lenses, this technology spread across the world, and it's still in use today.